As an example, take the story of Lonesome George, the last known individual of the Penta Island tortoise, a subspecies of Galapagos tortoise. Poor George, believed to be around 80 years old, was believed to be the last of his kind, and with no female we were facing the end of his subspecies. Then evolutionary biologists, using DNA technology, discovered a very closely related subspecies that appeared to have interbred with the Penta Island group in the recent past. Another individual of the same group was also discovered at the Prague Zoo, among other Galapagos tortoises. Unfortunately for George, it was another male. Current efforts are underway to see if George and the females from a related subspecies can create a hybrid offspring to preserve some of his genes. So far, they have been unsuccessful.